hello guys welcome to my youtube channel today i'm going to be walking you guys through 10 chrome settings you need to change immediately uh so here you can see i've opened my chrome browser so i'm going to navigate to my settings and uh when i open my settings and here you can see i'm, I'm already in my settings the first chrome uh settings we are going to change is how to close the background app so when i come to my settings i'll navigate to the systems here so here you can see continue running background apps when google chrome is closed so even when the google chrome is closed some background apps are being running and this can actually slow the speed of your machine so you can just go, go ahead here and just turn it off that's the first one i want to show you guys so the second one i want to show you guys is the safety check and how so how do we uh change that you come to your privacy and security here you open your settings come to your privacy and security so here you can see chrome can keep uh chrome can help keep your keep you safe from data breaches and bad extension and more so all you do is just click on this check now so when i click on that check now it's going to check device software everything is good extension uh safe browsing my password it identified that 46 password a week and update chrome is up to date so it's very very nice for you to do this uh safety check if you don't do it it's a safety check run a moment ago so it is very very important for you to do this so um the third one i'm going to show you guys is third party cookies if third party cookies are being installed on your machine then you can go ahead and uh block it so here i'll come to my privacy and security then I'll navigate to my cookies and other site data then i'll go down here to this uh block third party cookies if this is actually enabled on your system if it's installed on your system you can go ahead and do what and click this uh block third party cookies and that then that will be blocked on your machine so uh the fourth one to show you guys here is the enhanced protection and the and for you to uh, navigate to that enhanced protection you come to your privacy and setting then you come to your security here click on your security and you can see my own is turned on what does this enhanced protection does actually it protects you against dangerous websites download extension it warns you about password breaches which is very very important i see it it has taken time to highlight uh some of the features that it enables or it does and the first one here, it predicts and warn you about dangerous events before they happen it keeps you safe on chrome and maybe used to improve your security and it also warns you and if password are imposed in data breach which is very very important and other things here that's the fourth one which is the enhanced protection so uh the fifth one i'm showing you guys here is the uh domain name system uh, what this does is it actually makes sure that you are actually visiting a secured website this uh domain system this dns what it does is is it just it's just like a phone book a connection between your the browser and uh the the website so what it does is it upgrade navigation to H https and also warn you before loading site that don't support it so all you need to just come here and enable it so it will always use a secure protection uh for you that will be the fifth one so uh the other uh ones we have to come back here to this side here and the sixth one show you guys here is the site permission so for you to navigate to that setting you have to come to this privacy and settings then you come to this site settings here so click on it so here you can see uh the permission so you can see there are some websites that can locate that you can see sites can ask for your location so you can see some location see sites you can go ahead and turn off this other website can as well locate you you can go ahead and turn off this if you don't want that then here we have some camera some website if, unless you are using it for your remote work or some google meet meeting or all that else you have to turn this off else some website can actually uh see you or uh, see where you are sitting through your webcam and all that so you can just go ahead and turn this off it will enable another layer of protection the another one is this uh, microphone here sites can ask you to use your microphone unless you are using it if you're not using it then you have to go ahead and also turn off 
uh, this uh, feature here. Then another one I want to show you guys, which is the seventh one, the seven room setting, which you need to do is this uh, pop up and redirect. They are very, very annoying. Sometimes uh, you just be browsing on the website and some pop ups will just come up, and maybe your mouse just uh, mistakenly tap on it and it will direct you to the website. You can go ahead and turn those off as well. So you can see, don't allow sites to send pop ups or use the internet. Just come to your settings then come to your site setting your site setting here then after your permission scroll down a little bit you will see your pops ups at the direct you can go ahead and turn that off so uh the eighth one I want to show you guys is a blocking website that show uh, misleading ads so you come to your privacy and setting come to your site settings then after your pops ups you see something down here so we say additional content settings just click on it you will see an arrow there to show you then come to this ads here and open it if this is actually allowed you can block ads on site that show intrusive or misleading ads which is very very important you can go ahead and show that so if mistakenly you have stored some websites have stored your cookies and uh, you actually want to turn that off you really don't you want to clear all your data everything from any other uh, website you can come to this uh view permission and data store across site here so i need to just clear data from all clear all data just click on that and you can see any other data that any website has stored from your website it will be stored some of these things here are password that i've actually kept so uh in my own case i'll be leaving that but if you don't need that you can actually clear all all the data and you can see that about 1.1 gig total storage used by sites you can clear all, all of your data from the other website and store if you don't want any, any website to have your information so i'm going to show you guys here is a uh, uh the save permission uh if the save payment method uh if other website if your payment method have been saved on your browser other website can access it so if you actually want to stop them from accessing your save payment method come to this auto feed here then go to payment methods then you will see this allow site to check if you have payment methods. Other sites they can assess your payment method if it's actually saved on your browser. This Chrome extension here, so you can just go ahead and turn it off. You don't want other website to assess your your payment method, which can also help you secure your information. So you just go ahead and turn it off. Uh, for this video, that will be all. If you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to the YouTube channel, feel free to hit the subscribe button. Uh, thank you for watching. Stay blessed.